Welcome back to Info Squad, where information equals freedom. A hole the size of one of the Great Lakes has been found in Antarctica, and it has researchers scratching their heads. Substantial holes in the icy surface of Antarctica are called polyneas, and they're not uncommon. They are generally confined to the coastal regions. An international team of scientists have discovered a mysterious 80,000 square foot hole the size of Lake Superior, making it one of the biggest polyneas ever observed in Antarctica. The researchers believe the polynea may have been formed because of deep water in the southern ocean being warmer and saltier than the surface water. Ocean convection occurs in the polynea when warmer water comes to the surface and then melts the sea ice preventing new ice from forming. The team includes researchers from the University of Toronto and SOCOM from Princeton University. They are monitoring the area with satellite technology and using robotic floats that are capable of operating under the sea ice to finally shed some light on the polynea. According to the researchers who first discovered the Polynesia, it is currently in the middle of the winter season for Antarctica, and this area should be covered by a thick layer of sea ice. The peninsula is one of the fastest warming places in the world. The year-round temperatures at Palmer Station are up five degrees on average. Five degrees is an enormous increase in warming. That's a big story, and the glaciers give us a chance to bring that story to life. The ice-free area is an important new data point which will be used to test the newest climate models. The hole first showed up on satellite images on September 9th and researchers said it would be premature to blame the Polynesia on climate change. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Leave us a comment down below. If you like what we're doing here at Info Squad, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and we'll catch you in the next video.